I coded your ideas in Minecraft. And all I can say is be careful what you wish for. Let me show you what I did. Timothy Roy says, I wish we could throw bricks. You know what? Why not? I think more weapons in Minecraft is a great idea. And what better weapon than a brick? I mean, after all, it kind of just really makes sense. Come on. Come on. <gasps> a handful of bricks at your service. Now we just need to find our first victim. No, 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 I'm not that cruel. I don't suppose you were called testificate for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> the sounds, the sounds make it so good. What? <laughs> you don't like being hit by a brick? <laughs> what can you do? What? <laughs> Harper says, make it so that we can dye lanterns to get different colors. That sounds amazing. You know, that's not a bad idea, but we're gonna need better scenery for this. Okay, that is a little bit more like it, but we're gonna need just a little bit more light. This is a lantern. <gasps> But it's not just any lantern. Oh no, this is a lantern that can be dyed using any dye in Minecraft. My friends, what if I told you dyeing a lantern wouldn't just change the texture of the lantern, but also the light surrounding said lantern. I mean, how amazing is this? Colored lighting is something people have wanted for a very, very long time. I mean, come on, there's no better way to bring atmosphere to the world of Minecraft than providing colorful lighting. I mean, just come on, look at how amazing the lava looks in this- <laughs> Oh. Oh. I mean, it's barely noticeable, but even the purple glow from the amethyst crystals, it's so good! Carmel Hopkins says, you should add boulders to the new caves. That sounds like a dangerous, but amazing idea. Let's do it. Okay, 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 I think that is an amazing idea, especially for the new Caves and Cliffs update. Imagine it, you're exploring the new cave system when suddenly a giant boulder comes hurling at you. This is actually a feature we've secretly been working on on Origin Realms, and honestly, I probably shouldn't be showing you this because it's kind of a secret. But nevertheless, look at how amazing it is. It rolls around and interacts with the world in so many different ways, and if you're not careful, it will deal damage to you. Look at that, I can bounce it off of this crystal. Oh! Oh, it's so cool. I mean, how cool is that? Stay back, creeper. Trust me, you don't want any of this. Oh, you want more, is that so? <laughs> oh, you can't touch me and my boulders. Okay, like I said, I probably shouldn't be showing you this because it isn't actually even out yet. This and a ton of other awesome features are coming to Origin Realms soon. You can join using the IP on screen now. But I mean, come on, boulders. How amazing would that be? Even as a trap, it would be really cool if you could even dispense them out of a dispenser and actually have a boulder flying down at any enemies that come into your cave. Oh, the possibilities really are endless. Habru says, how about a cave version of the wandering traitor? Hmm, I don't know about that. Hmm. I don't think I've ever met anyone who liked the wandering traitor. And sure, in theory, a cave wanderer is a cool idea. They could sell cave-related items and be just as annoying. Maybe even more annoying. Let me show you why. <gasps> Diamonds! Ooh, don't mind if I do. Oh, hey, a cave wanderer. Wait, no! No! <sighs> okay, I, I, I've got this. <laughs> I can handle this. No, no problem at all. <laughs> it just... I'm safe. Uh, no, 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 stay, stay back, no, no, ah! not such a great idea now, is it? Ah! <coughs> well, isn't it just my lucky day? No, no, no. Isaac says, landmines, you give a sheep TNT and shear it, am I reading this right? <laughs> uh, I, uh, I, I don't. I don't really know what. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Everything in my Minecraft being is telling me not to do this. Oh! Oh! Okay. <laughs> I, 
I forgot there's a 25% chance that that happens. <laughs> All right. Let's try that again. <laughs> I really don't know where you get your ideas. Um, or uh, Landmines are a cool concept, but the fact that they come from a sheep is just strange. Um, uh, TNT landmine. <sighs> yep. <laughs> Diversified plays says add system Z to Minecraft. Oh no. W uh. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if Minecraft can handle one system Z. <laughs> Let alone two. Ah, ah, <laughs> what is ah. this? Random noises. Falling ah, noises. This idea is crazy. Ah. I coded your ideas in oh, no. Falling noises. Oh, it's a baby ah. system Z. <laughs> it's a, <laughs> it's a baby system Z. <laughs> Oh no. Oh! <laughs> and of course they randomly die. Uh, accurate though. What have I done? What have I done? AJ Lane says Ender Armor that has the same abilities as Enderman. Hmm. Uh, oh no. I understand what you're asking for, but I actually don't think you know what you're asking for. So Enderman, right? They teleport randomly. Oh, um, so I, I teleport randomly. <laughs> I got this. I got that. I can beat Minecraft as an Enderman. It's not that hard to <gasps> diamond. Don't mind if I do, but I gotta hurry. Got oh, I gotta hurry. Gotta hurry. Found some diamonds. Oh, no. <laughs> Get it off. I don't want to wear it anymore. There's only one way. Only one way. Wait, 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 what? No, no. Joshua says you should code an arrow so that when you shoot it, it will blow up. <laughs> That's it? Okay. Fear not, my friend. I know exactly what it is you would like. Explosive arrows, right? Arrows that explode when you shoot them. Uh. Uh. Ah. Uh. Well, that it, that is what you asked for. <laughs> on one hand, you could have explosive arrows that explode on impact. And on another hand, you can have arrows that just explode as soon as you shoot them. That is what you asked for. Oh, I think I know what you meant. Something like explosive enchantments for bows. That does make a little bit more sense and could be more useful. I get it now. And the best part is we have this on Origin Realms. Join using the IP in the description below. Hey, hey, hey. it's my friend. I'm Kibitz suggesting add Pickle Steve to mine. How am I gonna wait? You may be wondering how I got here. Yes, me, the pickle down on the bottom of the screen. Hi. It all started when I was swimming in the middle of the ocean and found a sea pickle and decided to make a drink out of it. Sounds great, right? And then I found a brewing stand in some random guy's house. Thanks, man. So then I mixed the sea pickle in with the awkward potion, and that's when things got awkward with the guy. I don't think he likes me in his house. <gasps> yes, this is gonna be tasty. In hindsight, I should have read the warning on the label, but I didn't do that. And so that's when it happened. I drank the pickle potion, and now I'm a pickle. Ah, uh, what a great suggestion. Monster Play says, imagine this. You're exploring the world of Minecraft and suddenly you see the Ender Chicken. Uh okay. Um I I don't I don't have words for this one, so let's just let's just check it out together. Um Okay. Seems pretty simple enough. Just an Ender Chicken. Nothing you know, nothing Oh Nothing too cr um, well, don't look at me. I, I, there it is. The inner chicken. I, I don't know what else, what else more it does. Um, I don't even know where it, oh, well, it's been here. Um, it lays into pearls. <laughs> why? Why? Oh, why? Ryan Young says, what about a totem that allows you to keep your stuff when you die? That's what I'm talking about. Oh great, I'm falling. And I have a lot of really important things on my inventory. Whatever will I do? 
I suppose it's a good thing. I have the totem of keeping on Origin Realms. It allows me to keep everything. Even though I might actually die, I still get to keep all of the important things in my inventory. I'd call that a win-win. No one of a... No one of a... Why can't I say that? A creeper horse, like a zombie or a skeleton horse, for no reason. Let's just do it. <sighs> All right, let's uh, let's get this last one over with. <sighs> yep, yep, creeper horse, spawn egg. <sighs> no comment. <laughs> this just, this doesn't need to exist. Why why does his face look like that? <laughs> no, 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 no. Get it over with. Get it over with! I think we made Minecraft worse. Yeah. Yeah, we definitely made Minecraft worse. Before we end today's video, I want to remind you to check out Origin Realms. It's not an ad. It's not a sponsorship. This is a server that I am directly involved with and continue to create things that I think you'll just enjoy. We're making it for people like you and me. I think you'll love it. And honestly, it's a great way to just check out some of the ideas you see in my videos just a little bit closer. So if you want to, the IP is on screen now. I'll see you there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Before you go, thank you so much for watching and for subscribing hopefully if not that's okay but i recently hit a million subscribers and not just that but the previous episode of i coded your ideas in minecraft really just blew up and it's actually incredible your support has been seen in the comments and honestly it encourages me to keep going and doing what i do i love to create i love to inspire and I love to learn from you guys, so it really just means a lot. But I'll keep it short. Thank you very much for watching and for joining me on this journey. Welcome to the System Z train. But that being said, if you enjoyed today's video, I think you might also enjoy these two videos that I picked out just for you. If you click to the left, you could see the previous episode of I Coded Your Ideas in Minecraft. And if you click to the right, you could see how I coded Enderman differently in Minecraft. Both are great. I think you're going to love them. And with that said, thanks for watching. Go ahead, you can go. All right, thanks for watching.